Smoking pot is medicine. It's a controversial issue that has people all fired up in a meeting going on right now. The dispute is over Colorado's medical marijuana law and the phrase primary caregiver. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez has been spending the day in this standing room only meeting. And Lance, the board is considering a proposal to limit the number of patients for a primary caregiver. The state wants to impose those limits uh, on how many patients they can provide marijuana to. Now, when voters approved the law, Anna, a caregiver was described as someone who has significant responsibility for managing the well-being of a patient. And the state says that caregiver is not synonymous with dispensary. But med medical marijuana advocates say that voters didn't intend for there to be limits. You're not dealing here with cocaine, heroin, or crack. Dr. Paul Bregman spoke out against the proposal, saying medical marijuana helps people who are sick and those who are in pain. I'm pleading with you. You don't get a plead from a doctor too often. But health officials say limiting the number of patients will ensure that each patient gets more attentive care. We asked how they chose the number five. And we believe that the five was, was uh, more in term with other models, primary care medical models that said, you know, we can make more than one visit in a day and significantly participate in a patient's managing the well-being of a patient. Opponents say that's hogwash. The health department already admitted back in 2007 that they picked the number five because the DEA, the United States Drug Enforcement Administration, suggested the number five to them. Caregiver Todd Young brought all nine of his patients to the meeting and asked them to stand. This passes. I would have to sit down and cut off half of my patients. One of them, Damien Lagoy, has AIDS. He says marijuana helps him cope with nausea from his life-saving medication. He doesn't want to look for another caregiver. If they don't allow him, then I'm back on Colfax looking for it. <laughs> now, proponents of the limit say there have been problems with the current system. They say a Westminster man, for instance, shared his medical marijuana with his four children. And one prosecutor says if the state can limit how many children a daycare operator can take care of, why not a caregiver for med medical marijuana patients? Live in downtown Denver, Lance Hernandez, 7 News. All right, Lance, so when will the board make a decision about all of this? And they'd originally planned to make a decision today, but there are 350 people that are signed up to testify wow. or at least to give word on how they feel. So we'll see how long it goes today. Anne? That's a packed meeting. All right. Thank you, Lance.